Hello everyone again. This is Easy from One Tech Stop, reviewing Lumi Denim on the Lumi 930. So if you own a Lumi 930, you probably got the Lumi Denim update. Uh, I just installed mine a couple of minutes ago. As you can see up here, we have in extras info to confirm Lumi Denim is installed. Uh, the first feature I'm going to take a look at is Hey Cortana. Um, by default, it is turned off, uh, obviously, because you have to train um, the voice assistants to actually recognize your voice in uh, passive. So as you can see, you have the train button here. And tap it and remember it does warn you uh, to find a quiet place um, hold the phone in front of you and train it to uh, recognize your voice so I'm going to do that real quick hey Cortana then you probably do this five times so she has as much precision so in case you're in a noisy environment she can still understand and I get to activate um, Cortana in your phone. I'm going to do it again. Hey Cortana. So you see, if she doesn't understand it, then you know you have to do it again. Hey Cortana. Hey Cortana. Hey Cortana. And for the last one. Hey Cortana, and there you go. So, um, she pretty much uh, does an average, I guess. Tries to recognize your voice, and in a few moments there, it should be ready. So there you go, success. Uh, we can try it out. So I'm just going to put my phone in lock mode. Hey Cortana, there you go. It's not as fast as um, OK Google, but uh, OK Google doesn't work if the phone is locked. So um, your phone does need that time to actually understand you are calling out to it. So that's a nice feature. So there's a Strider again. Let me close training now. Oh, that was clear training. No, I want to delete that so we can go back. And now you can see here Cortana is turned on. So we can do that again. Hey Cortana. What time is it? I don't know what to ask. So I'm um, whatever. So yeah, that's a quick look at the passive activation of um, your Cortana on. This actually just works on the Lumia 930 and Lumia 1520 uh, for now. Obviously, high-end phones will come out with the processing power to support it. So if you have a Lumia 930, 1520, you can check it out. Another feature we're going to look at is scheduled updates. So you probably hear me say that you're thinking Windows PC. So remember with Microsoft phones, you can schedule when to install updates like in Windows XP, Windows 7. Uh, Microsoft did bring that feature to uh, Windows Phone. It is available if you have preview uh, developer mode, then this shouldn't be a surprise to you. But you can actually choose when you want your firmware updates to actually install in your phone. So you can set this to, you know, an ideal time would be 3 a.m. because you're fast asleep and your phone's probably connected to your Wi-Fi, or even if you have it downloaded on the phone already, you can schedule when you want it to install. This is a really nice feature. I want to see more uh, Windows PC features come to the phone, especially with Windows 10. Uh, we probably would see more of this, um, but this is awesome. Uh, it reminds me of Windows XP when you set it up and you know you get to choose when to install your updates. It's nice to see that feature on Windows Phone. Uh, with Lumia Denim. Also, more features that were added to Lumia Denim 
um, additional toggle buttons were added to action center um, basically microsoft added battery saver and cellular data so right now you can easily just change um you know you can add a button here to just turn off your for instance here you can go here and shortcut to your camera or you can change that button and give it turn off your mobile data you can turn it on or off as you can see you can turn it off right here to save data or you can turn on your battery saver mode too so those two were recently added with the lumen denim update um, the seller data was really requested by windows phone users and it's good to see microsoft did listen and implemented it into the lumia denim update so now let's take a look at the major update uh, the major features that were brought into um lumia 930 via the lumia denim update and that is your camera so uh as you can see it starts up really fast and the ui kind of got tweaked a bit um, one of the main features is the reach capture which enables the reach capture mode there and as you can see just a few buttons here your uh, photos button here um, normal settings as before and your video recorder you know have a bunch of settings you can tweak same as before um, probably the new ui changes the settings one up here it takes you straight into your settings where you can choose what lens you want to use so you can see lens here you can choose from a bunch of lenses you can see some pre-installed apps like your Lumo refocus and the selfie app um, you have straight into settings for your front camera uh, you know basic stuff and your photos you can choose what ratio you want turn on living images uh, can choose what happens when you long press um, the camera key so it obviously does a video or you can choose a photo burst or just disable it altogether next up you can choose to record in 4k which is 2160p by 30 frames per second or you can use the normal 1080p or you can go 1440p uh, with 30 fps uh, you can also choose to enable surround sound, give you more audio quality to your videos. And, you know, the rest is your usual stuff. Um, one feature I was disappointed with um, the camera app, the UI is um, the nice feature from the native camera app with uh, Lumia devices or with Windows Phone, where you can swipe in to see your previous photos. Uh, here you actually have your gallery button up here that takes you into the galleries to see your pictures. Uh, I wish Microsoft would, if this is going to be the main camera app, we probably need to adopt um, that feature where you can just slide in to see previously taken photos. Like um, for instance, right here, I got a 1020 with, let's see if I can show that real quick. So as you can see, this is, I don't know. Uh, let's see. Go back here. Launch the camera app. So this is your native Lumia camera app. Uh, once you take a photo, it takes a long time to save. I'm going to show you the difference real quick in a bit. But you can see you can just slide in to see your previously taken photos. So. Um, I wish that feature was introduced with the Lumia app here. So, but yeah, to take a picture, just snap it once. Oh, that was a video. Just go to photos here. See how fast it is. And that was, you didn't even notice how fast that was, like a millisecond. That was really fast, I'm trying to move around. And that's how fast it takes pictures, but you can just slide in to see previously taken pictures. You need to go into the app here, then you can see your pictures it took. So um, that is really neat so with um, the Lumia Denim update. Next up is let's demo the wish capture feature on the Denim. Let's see here. 
So as you can see, you have extended settings. Most of the settings you see here can be accessed from the menu bar on top. Um, you can use the arrow here to see more settings. And there you see the rich capture, turn that off, turn it on. What it does is it takes a picture in HDR or dynamic flash, uh, where it takes a picture in different light levels, then you decide to pick um, which one best suits you. So for instance, I did take a few pictures just to show you a quick example of what I mean. So for instance, this picture, I'm gonna edit with rich capture. So you can choose the default picture. You can go with the picture with flash and no flash, and you can customize. This is the best part. So you can actually adjust the light level of that picture. This is after the picture was taken. You can actually adjust the light levels there. This is really, it's a really cool feature. It says like turning the lights on. Another example to show you real quick. This picture here, and there it is capture. So again, you can choose if you want it with flash, no flash, or default, or you can customize. And you can just, as you can see there, you can adjust the light levels, which is really neat. Yeah, so that's a look at risk capture feature. And once you choose what levels you're comfortable with, you can just hit ready, and it would actually process. Um, this is the advanced uh, image processing algorithm they talked about with uh, Lumia Denim. So it takes a while to, so it saves that current picture and that's it. Then lastly, we're going to talk about um, Lumia Moments where you pretty much hold down the camera button and it records a video in 4K frame by frame. So as you can see, record the video there, and after you're done, just let go, and it saves it. Stop it there. So you can later go back to that video, and you can select moment, and you can choose a best frame. So say you record this changes picture taking on a whole new level because say you're taking picture of friends you can just hold down the camera button and just record and in your spare time you can just choose the best frame so for instance i just recorded a 20 second video I just pick this so it loads it up Then you can choose the different frames. So these are all the frames you can pick from. So you can choose the best frame picture. So imagine you have friends in there. You can choose from the multiple frames you took uh, the best picture for them. And once you pick one, you can just hit the save and that's it. Or you can do an action shot. Unfortunately, I can't do one right now because there weren't any moving objects in the picture. But as you can see, yeah. Say they were moving objects in the video, you can just choose ready. Uh, it creates the action shot. Um, I should get an error message saying there weren't any moving objects in that video, but let's see what happens. Yeah, so it says the video, because usually you should have the camera still and just, yeah. so yeah, that wasn't a nice example. I probably would produce a few action shots um, in the next video, or just keep an eye out on our blog uh, upload them soon but yeah that's a quick look at Lumia moments uh, one of the yeah, extended features on Lumia denim available on 930 and 1520 hey Cortana nice sure who's the text going to what yeah no text but yeah, that's a quick look at Lumia Denim. I'm running on a Lumia 930. Um, most of the improvements were imaging centric. Um, the only thing outside of imaging probably was um, the extra buttons for your action center up here and the Hey Cortana feature. Uh, this is a well worth update. 
um, if you have a 9, 10, 15, 20, check them out. And uh, don't forget to leave a comment uh, down below. Thanks for watching.